All right, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Over the Modern Repentance. Today, we're going to hop into Eden, because you know how I feel about Eden. I think he is a... Okay, I mean, this is an interesting run, but I think he's just a fun character, especially with uh, modded. Now, one thing I would like to point out is you'll notice we don't have uh, external light and description mod on. There's even a couple more mods we've turned off, because unfortunately, uh, the game decided it was just done. Uh... I have not been able to, like, you might have noticed that yesterday there was no episode to Overly Modded, and I do apologize about that, but it's not, it's, it's like semi my fault, okay, it's not fully my fault, but it's definitely partially my fault, um, there were two reasons yesterday why I didn't upload an episode, uh, number one, and also there is the same reason why, and yes, we're doing that, I know it hurts me, I just, I, I really feel like having those as an option, but, uh, yeah, so, for one, I was extremely tired. Now, that's the part that is... Oh, no. Okay, we're fine. That's the part that's definitely on me. Um, I mean, it's only partially on me. Like, it was my fault, yes, but it also needed to happen. So, basically, I decided to uh, not sleep at all last night. Because... Not last night, but the night before. So, yesterday, I was on zero hours of sleep. Because I wanted to try to fix my sleep schedule. And I figured, you know... Uh, a good way to do that is to not sleep and sleep rather than the next day, as long as you do everything correctly and you don't, like, oversleep the next day or end up passing out halfway through the day, then, like, it, it can genuinely help as long as it goes right. And there's a lot of things that have to go right, so it's not, like, a guarantee, but I still wanted to try. And, oh, good, good use of a bomb. Um, and I did, I did try, and I did fix my sleep schedule, and honestly, uh... I'm still fucking exhausted right now because I have, I got like a little less than six hours sleep last night, okay, because I woke up at five on the dot, I don't know why I didn't have an alarm, but I woke up at 5am on the dot, and I remember it being 11, which means I probably fell asleep at like between 11.30 and 12, right, um, so I'm, basically what that means, I got like five and a half hours sleep most likely, um, and even on a normal day, that that's not horrible, but the worst part is on a day where you had gotten no sleep beforehand, you know, I was really hoping to, like, get a lot of sleep, right? Like, I think that just makes sense. I, I was hoping to get a lot of sleep, and instead, I just, I very simply did not. Um, so, ow, uh, not ow, but, you know, more like a mental ow. Like, I am very tired, and zero chance we're not getting, uh, we're not getting those gold chests, by the way. I will find the way to get them. Uh, one of these again. Why are there so many, uh, it's actually good to have a burp, uh, burp pill. Okay, I mean, we got some good shot speed. I'm not gonna burp the shot speed, believe it or not, but, like, how do we get our keys? Like, you're gonna actually tell me there's just no keys this floor? Because that's very rude. Yeah, no, that's that. Alright, so, uh, screw you, game, basically. I cannot believe you're gonna be two golden chests and just no keys. Uh, we tried. But yeah, so, like, I, uh, I'm very tired. I'm very, very, very tired. So yesterday, obviously, like, today I'm tired, right? Uh, and today was after sleep, so you can imagine how tired I was yesterday. The answer is very very fucking tired like I, I would genuinely okay we want to keep popping pills right now we're holding the burp so it's gonna be it's gonna make it so whatever the first really good pill we get we get to have two of them also thank you for finally giving me those keys i guess but actually realistically screw you uh yeah but like so i'm, I'm exhausted yesterday naturally i was way more exhausted and blah 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 right not that i haven't said this 12 times while trying to record um, and that caused some issues when it came to recording, right? Because recording while really, really, really tired, it, it can be a lot. It can genuinely be, like, a lot of effort to get through a, a long-ish recording. Because Isaac is, I would say, 40 minutes on average. So, it can take a lot of effort to get through a 40-minute a long recording where I'm talking the entire time and have to keep it relatively interesting and stuff. Um, with no way to do that. Also, we should probably check what our trinket does, because I feel like if you have a dice trinket, not knowing what it does is usually pretty dangerous, so let's figure that out. But, yeah, so that was adding towards why I didn't... How do you fucking drop things? I've been holding the wrong button, clearly. Okay. Oh, wait. 
Um, charred dice, return from the chaos. Here's the thing. Uh, unless this encyclopedia tells us what the trinket does, we're never going to learn. Because I have no idea. Trinkets. Uh... Inventory. Okay. Oh, uh, Ipec Okay. Oh, well, it's from the Ipecac Community Mod. And here's the thing. Ipecac Community Mod does not have good uh, integration with Encyclopedia. So, we won't be able to find out the exact use of this trinket. So, we're just gonna act like we don't have it, I guess. But first, let's do this. Donkey's Jawbone. Uh, what does this do? I remember this from... Uh, no, 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 don't, don't join. I remember this from... What, what fucking anti-birth item pack? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When Isaac takes damage, to spin. No, no, no. That's bad. Now I have, now I fully remember it, and it's funny, but it's not great. This is pretty darn good. I mean, it's Tech L, right? I'm, you're not gonna see me complain about Tech L. Uh, it, it's just funny, and it makes a good noise. And it's like the iconic modded item, because it was like from episode one or some shit. But, uh, yeah, so, yesterday, uh, like I said, uh, about three million times, being tired is part of the reason why, uh, I didn't record, well, didn't upload, but, but, and also, yesterday was supposed to be a stream day, but to be fair, uh, I had streamed for two days in a row anyway, so, like, technically, I was ahead, so that's fine, but, uh, yeah, so I was just too tired, but, uh, here's the thing, it doesn't matter how fucking tired I am, I'm gonna at least try to record, and I'll spend a good, like, all day trying to record, right? It's not like I'm doing anything else, I'm just kind of waiting for the day to end, so I can go to sleep. Um, so yeah, like, basically, can you need to tell me RoboBaby 2.0 doesn't have a single upgrade? You greedy fuck. Uh, how about Robo Bum Baby? He eats batteries, doesn't he? That's, like, not optimal. Um, I actually do like my batteries. Mirrored landscape. Um, I used it and now my active item is a pocket active. Let me tell you, a pocket active coupon is not bad at all. In fact, that's pretty solid. But yeah, so, what? Well, where the fuck am I? I'm tired, right? I'm pretty sure I said that at least 12 times in this one video. I'm sorry. Um, on top of that, overly modded was not cooperating. And what I mean by that is... It was crashing, and I want to say every, like, three minutes. Like, and I don't mean, like, it would crash and I could load back in and continue the video. I mean, it would be those kind of crashes where the game crashes and you can't just load the game again, right? Like, that kind of crash. Um, so, it would ruin every recording I tried to do. I'm sitting here trying to, like, you know, do my shit, get my recording done, even though I'm tired. And it's hard enough to to re-record the same, at least parts of a video, on repeat, saying the same thing. So it's the same intro, it was the same question of the day, and on now all that's changed. Now, we, now we're spiraling into whatever rant I'm on now. Um, but like, yeah, like, it, it was just impossible to keep doing this. So after like, three or four hours of uh, separate, it wasn't like in a row, but like three or four hours of attempts yesterday, I finally just said, you know what? This is physically not worth my time, and I need to stop. I'm too tired. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna vibe, and you can go screw yourself. Um, so yeah, I eventually gave up, and then today came around, and here's the, here's the real kicker. The crashing didn't get better. It's, I'm not gonna lie, Catacombs 1, this is like the furthest I've made it in a while, but like, in general, the crashing wasn't much better. Um, I have disabled a few mods, uh, as I believe I said, but I don't remember if I said it or not. But yeah, I've uh, I've deleted a few mods, not deleted, but disabled, just because they looked, they gave off the appearance that they were causing problems. And that's a problem, because I, I checked my logs and they were talking about some things from, like, Loot Deck, for instance, and I'm like, well, if Loot Deck's gonna be a problem, it can get the fuck out, because realistically, while I think Loot Deck is a cool mod, I can play overly modded without it, right? So, we got rid of a few, not just that one, but we got rid of a, a good, good a handful of them, and it seems to be more, I'm not saying it is stable, That that's too much of a jinx, but it seems to be more stable for the time being, which I'm definitely a fan of. So, 
unfortunately like i said i am still really tired so i apologize about like the lack of energy and probably skill on the screen and blah 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 um i apologize for that but hopefully hopefully soon uh as a result of this trade-off uh i will actually be able to like have better quality videos because i won't feel super rushed because they're basically with editing and stuff i didn't like i'd be up till this is a really really good item this is from the curse collection it adds a as like a 15 unless i'm making that number up i think it's a 15 might as well pop coupon by the way okay i guess there was no real point in popping coupon in fact we'll pop we're basically trying to get mystery present right okay well that one that went well but uh yeah there's like a 15 percent chance that any room you enter uh it's better for smaller rooms for sure because like in this room we're kind of searching right now but we don't see, uh there ended up not being one but uh the you can get a red button to spawn in any room you enter so like if you enter a room and then there's a red button obviously it works like a normal red button in that if you step on it all the enemies die it just means that i can do this and clear some rooms that is like that's really good right that's really strong we like to see it um i like to see it anyway personally that's just like a that's a 10 out of 10 for me uh also you just take the damage sometimes right but uh yeah like that that curse of creation why would you do this to me leave me alone curse of creation please get out of here you are so annoying you oh, i actually really like that curse but yeah, um, I don't think buttons work on bosses, and I, I don't even think they can spawn in boss rooms, but uh, yeah, even if they, I don't think they can work on bosses, basically. I, I, in fact, I don't think the buttons can spawn in any special room at all, if I remember correctly, so you won't find them randomly in your item rooms, you're not going to find them in a boss challenge room or boss rush or anything, anything like that, just no special rooms at all, um, which is completely fair, right? Like, you're not going to see me being like, what the fuck, why can't I instantly kill every boss in the game? No, like, see, I think that's a, I think that's a valid thing. Uh, speed up is actually really nice for the speed we have. Uh, now that we have a little bit of speed up, I mean, we're slow as hell anyway. We might as well go a little slower. We basically have a 20% chance, uh, by the way, I've been, the number's gonna keep going up, uh, because I want to assume it's, like, 50% chance to spawn a button, because that sounds better than 15. But, uh, yeah, we basically have, like, a 25% chance every room we enter to get a button to spawn, and, like, that means a 25% chance every time we enter a room just uh to win and like do you do you see that i mean sure that last button didn't really help us because there was only two spiders alive that were almost dead when we used it but you know but you know it was cool okay now we're gonna move on what was in that shop it was uh the the, the coin baggie i mean i guess we can try to get the mystery gift sorry i am like like i said uh so goddamn tired we can try to get the mystery gift we do have the coupon still in our little pocket active slot. There we go. Now we pop a mystery gift in the secret room. Oh my god. I wish we had a golden bomb right now. I really wish we had a golden bomb right now. I don't know if a golden bomb would break the game necessarily and like guarantee us a magic mush, but I think it would like I think it'd be pretty damn close, right? Okay. Um give me something good to eat. This looks like trash. This is trash. Uh, I think it has a small chance to pay out with like a specific item and then go away upon use. And other than that, it gives us flies. So like, if I'm going to be honest, not quite what I added mine, but it didn't really cost us anything. So I think it's all good. Anyway, moving on to the next floor. All right, we are back. I apologize about that. Um, I had to pause because... I was like half asleep and I thought, you know what, I could use about five minutes. Let me adjust my mic too, sorry about that. Yeah, I was like, I'm about to like fall asleep, so let's just kind of vibe for a sec. And now I'm like laying down in my chair while I'm playing. And this, you know what, I feel much more at home. Now you dirty bastard, pull that shit on me again and watch what happens. Um... Torn photo page with the satanic bible, I'm sure is good. I don't really know what it does. Uh, torn page is a different effect for every book. Uh, well, not necessarily. Like, for instance, uh, 
if you have torn page, it, it just affects books is the main point. But if you have torn page, this is a really, really fucking good room. Holy shit. That's a restock machine with a crane game. That's really solid. Um, but yeah, so if you have the Wiz with, uh, sorry, no, if you have the, what the fuck's it called? Telepathy for dummies. There we go. With the torn page, it'll give you the whiz effect with homing as well. So that way you get... What the hell are you? Athlete's foot, it hurts to move. The more you move in a room, like the further you move in a room, the faster you shoot. I mean, that makes sense. All this means is like... Oh, so it goes down if you... I guess... So if you're, yeah, it's just like the more you move in a room, the faster you shoot. But if you stop moving, it goes down. So that's interesting. I mean, it doesn't, it's not going to be great or bad. It's just going to kind of exist. But uh, anyway, yeah, like Crane Game Machine, really good room place. Uh, we, we want money, but we need to get money. I'm not sure, like, Tabloid Vive alone is really good, and there's two more items behind it, and even if they're really bad, there's a reroll machine. But of course, even though we have coupon, we're still somehow freaking broke. So, we need to find a way to get some money going, because uh, as of right now, we're not only not going to afford that, we're not going to afford, like, anything. Um, but yeah, so, I don't know what Torn Page is going to do, but it does some cool things with some things. Uh, coupon, I guess. And then we can Mr. Me this, hopefully. And then we fail, cry forever, and we have to wait for another freaking coupon. But, uh, yeah. So, like, I have no idea what Torn Page does with, uh, with Satanic Bible. They do something, I believe. I know with some, uh, books it just lowers the charges required, but it doesn't look like it does that with Satanic Bible. So I have no idea. I'm sure whatever it does, it's great, though. Just give me tech point five. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, screw you. In one second, guys. Hold up. I apologize for what feels like already the 12 millionth cut of the episode, but thank you for bearing with me. How the fuck are we going to actually get such a good arcade and get genuinely not a single thing out of it? That's going to be so ridiculous. Like... It's not like we're just not getting a lot out of it, or it's, like, not even that good of an arcade. It is actually, like, a really, really solid arcade, and we are going to get actually nothing out of it. Which is somehow really hard to believe, but it's happening. Uh, it's just, it's really unfortunate, if we're being honest. It, it really sucks, because that room has so much potential if you're, like, someone that isn't me. But as me, um, I can tell you it's basically useless. Also, uh, my guess is Satanic Bible might have, like, the Necronomicon effect along with Satanic Bible. That, that's one of the only things I can think of that it would, uh, it would get that wouldn't be too strong from this trinket. So, that's my guess. Uh, and if that is true, that is not great because nine times out of ten we're going to use this whenever it's ready. And the problem with that, does it turn? No, okay. So, yeah, it turns our health into things. I was just wondering if uh, it would just turn empty our containers into it because it was a pill and it acts weird or something. But, yeah, so, like, basically, screw this, uh, and I'm sad. Okay, uh, yeah, we're broke, and we got nothing out of that entire arcade. Uh, that's so goddamn dumb. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that's like on a scale of 1 to 10, that's like stupid as hell. Alright, let's kill this boss. Like, maybe we get Pageant Boy, right? And like, maybe from Pageant Boy we get like 70 cents from just all bimes. Is that even possible? I don't know. Uh, but maybe. And if that does happen, maybe we get one fucking crane game payout with that. I know we're not like super behind on luck or anything for the crane game, by the way. It's not like I think we're being necessarily extremely unlucky. I just think it sucks that we got such a good thing, just, and it's completely useless. Unless that's a regular challenge room right there, and not a bad, a boss one. Because if it's a regular challenge room, we could theoretically find some, uh, find some money.
but I have no idea. Um, we could also go technically play the uh, self sac room, but yeah, that is a boss challenge room, so that's officially off tables. Unless I uh, play this sac room, which now we gotta. I want to play it till I see at least tech point five. Oh no. This is the 100%. I was going to say how we throw this run, but this actually seems like very much worth what we've given so far. Okay. Um. Okay, so now we're done because let me tell you, everything past this point just doesn't matter. Uh, we have a heart there. We go check out what's in the boss challenge room. If it's a uh, pageant boy, then we definitely take it because we want the money. Oh, we got, oh, we got a little incubus as well uh, from, this is a black card. I say this is worth it. Yeah, we got a little incubus as well just from like Cambian Conception, which we picked up a while back. And I completely forgot we had that. But yeah, we do. We have Cambian Conception. So we got an incubus, which is obviously like one of the better familiars in the game. So if we could choose a familiar to get, that's pretty much the one we'd be choosing. So I'm definitely happy about that. I wish Coupon would just work on crane games and stuff so I could get free plays. Alright. I mean, overall, that was a uh, that, that was a really solid uh, boss challenge room for us. And even though we spent a lot of health and got into a very dangerous position, we're coming out with a perfectly fine amount of health. I mean, Red, Heart, Red Hearts are obviously lacking. However, Red Hearts don't matter uh to put it simply like they really don't so i'm not necessarily worried that we are gonna blow up this pot because please that's not a thing i'm gonna look for uh, a way to get one more payment because we want like we really 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 want um we have book of sin and this is good because a it lets us get one more payment B, we're going to coupon and hopefully get uh, the the like thing of batteries. And hell yeah, we get tech point five. This is the this is the main thing we wanted. So now we have like a lot of tech action going on, which I'm a big fan of. But now we're going to coupon in there, try to get the battery bundle. And then we're going to use Book of Sin however many times we can with the batteries. And hopefully get like a dime out and then just get lucky with two more plays. Uh, or like just one more play and a reroll, whatever works. Okay, there's only one thing we don't want to coop on here, and it's legitimately that. Um, doesn't shock me at all if we're being honest. Uh, yeah, no, that's that's absolutely fucked. Like that was the that was the one thing. Um, if we had three cents, we would have just bought it, but of course we didn't because we've been struggling with money this entire run. So like that was kind of the point behind doing that. Uh, fuck you, game. You're basically a giant uh, coward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that, that's a coward move. Especially this uh, this fucking confessional play. Absolute coward move. We've pretty much done everything this floor has to offer. We do need to go get our actual um, active item back. Okay. This run uh, sucks. And you can tell me it doesn't suck all you want. Wait, did we have an active item? What were we using before? I have no idea. Um... The Ignobius run doesn't suck, and that it's pretty good. But, like, we've done so much min-maxing for, like, nothing. I don't know. It just, it feels, uh, like, very, uh, just average. I feel like we're min-maxing way more than normal, and, like, we're only decently strong. Yeah, I mean, we're 21 minutes in on Flooded Caves, too, right? Like, that's just annoying. There's nothing fun about that. Uh, I don't like roguelikes that take over like an hour. I think that's always a bad time frame for a roguelite. I think they should take under an hour. But it's like the only way to consistently win at Isaac if you want to consistently win is to put that much time into it. So if you're not min-maxing everything, you can kiss your fucking dreams and winning goodbye. You got At that point, you're just hoping you get lucky. Like <laughs> you can, you can min-max a lot of wins in Isaac. That's kind of like how Isaac be. But like... You know, if you don't min-max, you're, you're just missing out on so much. It just feels not worth it. Midweek Madness. You know what? I still haven't learned what that uh, that trinket does. So I'm just not going to worry about it. And we're going to keep Midweek Madness. 
Because whatever midweek madness is, I'm sure it's really good. And we still haven't found a use for that burp either. Because we haven't found any, like, balls of steel or anything, like, really good. We've just found, like, oh, here's a shot speed up. Oh, here's, like, experimental pill. That was, like, actually pretty good. But experimental pill is different every time you use it in a run. So, like, even though the first experimental pill got was good, that doesn't mean experimental pill is general is good. It could easily be like a tears down shot speed up next time, and we don't want that. Um, I would also like if we could get potentially a deal with the devil. Because I don't think we've actually had the opportunity to uh, coupon a deal with the devil yet. I think we've always either... I think we've just had some reason not to. Also, can we talk about the fact that we have battery baby robo baby robo baby 2.0 tech point five and tech l in one run and then incubus who is shooting tech so realistically we have four different five different robo babies if you count me as a robo baby and incubus as a robo baby this is the most robo run i've ever fucking seen and i would like to keep uh keep it going we could get more robo in this for sure um we could go for an angry robo jams moment uh, or we could just, I don't know, there's like actually other Robo Babies. Not quite what I had in mind, if I'm being honest, uh, to buy that. Not quite it. But, you know, I, I guess that uh, the game felt like that I wanted to do that. And I know what you're thinking, you fucking did it, you idiot. No, I, I understand the fact that I genuinely did it. I'm just saying I didn't want to. And if you don't understand that, you're a little, you're a little piss baby, okay? As simple as that. Uh, yeah, this is just depths one. That means we can go. However, let's not go because we're guaranteed to get a deal with the devil. So we might as well try to get a coupon charge because we fucked that up again. Um, so let's, let's see if there's six rooms we can clear somewhere hidden on this floor. Um, yeah, we're going to take a lot of damage in the process. It's just, you know, it's part of the process. Uh, but, ooh, wait, how did we miss this chest? Okay, well, it turns out it's like almost useless. But, uh, yeah, so, like, if we don't get the coupon, we're gonna feel pretty damn dumb, if I'm being honest, because we just talked about that. Like, we just brought that up and said, I was like, man, I can't believe we haven't gotten the coupon on a devil deal yet. It's looking more and more like I can potentially pull this off, but you also know we're gonna be, like, one room short. I don't know. As long as, as, long as all the current rooms that we see on our map are combat rooms, we're good. But there's no proof they are. Like, this one isn't. If there's not an extra one to the left now, I swear I'm going to cry. Yay, we did it. Okay, um, I was a little worried that, you know, that wouldn't happen. But let's go beat the boss. And let's go coupon our devil deal. I think potentially this could lead to something fun. We also would love to upgrade our familiars. But, you know, we've been broke for this entire run. So... Being able to upgrade familiars, well, that's way too much of a luxury for us. We can't quite afford that. I need to get the uh, the fast travel mod, because let me tell you, I just think Isaac is shit and poorly designed. I don't like spending too much time in it. Like, oh no, fast travel would be too overpowered in the game like Isaac. Uh, we need to make sure that they get all the playtime, because obviously, them any playtime is good playtime. Not, not, it has nothing to do with quality, it's about quantity, is what I'm trying to say. You know? Um, I don't know what the right item is, and it costs more than left, so we buy Sanguini Bond, and we take Spirit of the Night, and then we use the Speed Up Pill, and then we buy Azazel's Rage. And you know what? Those are three pretty okay deal with the Devil items. That wasn't horrible. They're not great, but it wasn't horrible. Also, yes, guess what? Uh, I am pulling the classic pause the recording again. Alright, okay, okay, okay. I am totally ready to finish this run. I want, I wish our run was just better. Okay, I know the run is good. I'm not saying the run isn't good, okay? Hear me out here. That is not what I'm saying. The run is definitely a really good run and thank you for the good run. However, I am so goddamn tired, okay? And we are 25 minutes in on the depths too. I want like a, a dummy busted run that we're done with the run by now because I am just too tired to... To want to sit here and play this game for, for forever. You know, I still have to record and do a whole edited video too. I don't even know what I'm doing for that yet. So, 
I would just like this run to be over. All right. Um. Thank you, game, for so far not crashing. If it crashes beyond this point, um, guess what? That's the video you get. You you get what you get, and you don't get upset, right? Um. So, just be happy that you got that much of a run. But uh, I don't think it's gonna crash. I have a feeling that I disabled the right mods uh, to to stop that from happening. But we'll find out basically if. Also, yeah, we're just gonna leave. Um, if it does crash again, that sucks. Like I said, that's just gonna be, that's gonna be the video, and I think that's comp completely fair. Then again, like, we've had videos that are probably shorter than this one already. Like, we're already past the point of some of our shorter videos, and I mean, and I don't mean edited ones because obviously some edited ones are real short, but that's just how edited content that you cut things out of works. Damage will help us go fast. You got like. If you look at the statistics, the negative is technically faster because it makes me go faster. So we'll take the negative and then we'll start booling. One thing I would like to point out, I really feel like we didn't get many buttons. I feel like the buttons were super common early on and the buttons just kind of said no and then they stopped. Mm, is there a chance that no i mean no 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 the mod creator is too is too uh is too much smarter than me there's no way that this is an oversight so i was thinking is, it, is there a chance that buttons can't spawn in modded rooms but i literally give that like a zero percent chance of being uh true and that, that that's how confident i am in uh the mod being made better than that and if I'm wrong and, the mod and that is the problem, then I'll probably cry myself to sleep for weeks on end, potentially months. It, it all depends. Uh, well, Emperor on... Re yeah, I mean, realistically, we, we probably want to Emperor on, uh, on this shoal because I hate that floor. So, I, I, while I would like to do it much sooner, like, I don't know, actually right now... If we're looking at speed stat, this is uh, the faster choice is to play slower, basically. Which is, uh, it's it's always a tortoise and the air situation, right? Like, it's always the case where, like, you just really want to go fast, but you, and so you start going fast, but you know the best way to go fast is to slow it down a little, but you hate it, because you're like, well, even though I physically know this is helping me go fast, it really feels like such anti-progress that I want to cry. Um, well, Damocles is, is a, is an obvious no from me. Uh, don't get me wrong. I love Damocles. However, well, I'm going to take it. It's just, it's not like, it's not a smart idea. It doesn't really help us from this point. Uh, we won't get any boss items from it, like, anymore because we're going, we're on mom's heart. Um... Yeah, like, it, Damocles just, it's not gonna do much, unless you got, like, if we got an item drop right there, it would've helped, okay? Right there would've helped, but we didn't. Also, we are legally allowed to, uh, take curse room damage now, so that's good. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna start stacking up. I mean, here's the thing, this is, this is just gonna be weird, right? I mean, we got, we got Damocles, but... Basically, all we have is the negative downside to Damocles, where uh, getting hit makes us die, right? Because the, the item doubling, it's barely going to affect anything. It'll affect some things. Um, I even think, I really feel like chest items work with it. I, I felt, I remember for the longest time thinking they didn't, and then I remember feeling like they did. So my guess is either at some point it changed, or I got a mod and it changed it, or I'm really dumb. One of those several things happen for sure. Um, and I don't really care which one it is. Because all I know is I think I'm right now. And sorry for punching you square in the face. Uh, I punch my microphone a lot whenever it's in the current position it's in. Because it's in it's in the kind of spot where like if I raise my arms, I'm just going to punch it. Right? And that's not optimal for not punching it. It just leads to, it just leads to accidental punches. Right? And sometimes you just got to... You just gotta soldier up and accept that you get punched in the face, right? And I respect that you accept it. Okay. We've managed to make it to the mom's heart fight, which is really good because we're gonna try not to get hit, but it's probably we're probably getting hit here. I'm very bad at the mom's heart fight. Uh but we have an emperor card for next floor. So if we can be god gamers like that. We should be able to make it past Satan now. Um, we're going to get hit on the Satan fight. That's almost a guarantee. 
Especially on the... We just used our fucking coupon. That was my coupon, man. Oh, I'm not happy. Um, oopsie. Uh, but yeah, like, we'll get in at some point. Especially the frickin' the foot stompy bit. I'm very bad at the foot stompies. Uh, I don't know why. It's just, it wasn't built into my, like, into my being to stompy my feet correctly. Well, I guess they're not my feet. They are the feet of Satan himself, and I'm not even the one stompying them. I'm dodging the stompies. But it wasn't built into me to, to dodge stompy correct, right? Like, I feel like feet are just something that I'm so naturally attracted. No, I'm, I'm, I'm joking. I take it back. I'm sorry. It was a meme, and now someone's going to believe me, and I've, I've dug myself into that hole. And you know what? I don't give a shit. Moving on. All right. We're still not in... Damocles danger territory, but the thing for me is once I proc Damocles, I get a good five seconds before um, Before it kills me, so We got to be careful. Uh, we'll take this. I don't know what this is. We're taking necromatic bone charm, of course I don't think we'll need help for the rest of the run. So let's find out what this does Unless it's a Ipecac, Of course. Oh, no, it's an Ipecac community mod, so we can't check what it does so we'll never know. Uh, but we do can join now, yeah? Yeah, okay. Um, let's be as careful as we can be. Right? Uh, this is... Like, D Damocles, it, it... Okay, we're dead. Um, you might think, Oh, you're on the last floor of the game. Just go fast. You'll be fine. That is where you are so fucking wrong. Uh, Damocles, just to clarify, it doesn't get more likely to kill you the more you get hit so like once you get hit the first time do not be scared of getting hit more but i just need to prove to you guys that damocles literally hates me i guarantee you in a few seconds or even better yet right before we win we're just gonna go down um and also i'm glad that there are all these buttons but it doesn't matter when we're not going the right way um okay still currently not going the right way dude why why do we have to go and it's not you can blame it on me and like not knowing how to read a map all you want until you realize that that's actually fucking like entirely luck based you once you explore a certain number of rooms you can make like some educated ga uh, ga gases gases uh, i don't know why i was thinking like gators and guesses but you know uh that's fine you can make some educated guesses on the as to where you know i hate this room uh, as to where to go next, but like not when you're that early on when you're that early on you're just taking a gamble and uh, My my gamble sucked Okay, uh This is an item that gives us curses. Oh my god. Wait the actual boss fight, please Dude, we do not care about taking damage We just need to get in there deal as much damage as possible, which means getting hit for curse of the tower procs No. No, let me in. Oh, we actually want to run. Holy shit, I never saw it coming. Um, wow. I actually wasn't ready for that. Uh, that was the run, I guess. Uh, that was tech with the tech baby. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you please, and I'll see you next time.